I'm so tired of you black folk walking around looking all evil like that's going to change something. Looking all mean, talking all crazy. Let them tell you about your children. If I sit here today and these are all white folks and they're putting some sleeping pill in my water and I sit up here and those of them go to sleep and everybody told in the world, niggas is lazy. They tired. No, that's because you too naive enough to know what they putting in my water, okay? Your children ain't violent because they black. They ain't violent. Most people in the world live in a ghetto. They don't kill people. What are you putting in my malt liquor? By the White Lake in grandmother's land, lived about eight clans. In the midst of the tribes and the wives and children, stood a very brave man. His look disturbed as he came into the chief tents for the third time. Drenched, convinced that little waters exist. For the third time, he was with us during a vision ceremony. We haven't seen him since. Agitated, he started punching his own hand with his fist. The chief said, Tall Bear, you're losing your wits. You must get a grip. The ant people want your attention, and you must resist. There was no little waters with us at the fire pit. But chief, he did exist. I'm not sick. He's the one we shared our peace pipe with. He spoke wonderful and righteous. Discipline, enlightenment. Do you remember during the ceremony? We took the trumpet plant to see in advance. Our visions did enhance, and you warned us of the ants before we slipped into a trance. Little waters, and you over there, you put an eagle feather in his hand. I know because during the ceremony I glanced. You said you felt the power of the yak and the elk. Little waters played the drums to bring back your health. The chief said, Please, tall bear, relax yourself. Maybe we should bring in some tribes' women and ask them for help. So as the night storm, tall bear went on and on on how they spoke on upper planes and other life forms and how little waters captured the bison to visit their boyhood. The joys of the white owl in the oak woods, the spirit journey to the snow walls. Did the horse dance, sing a rain song? I came and gone, this is no good. Chief said, tall bear, I knew and spoke to you for many years. I wish your grandfather was still here, but this case is so rare. People and memories just don't disappear. I have no idea, but please have a seat right here. Maybe you're going crazy. Have you had sleep lately? Then he called for the tribes and the medicine ladies. They arrived with great urgency. What's the emergency? Chief said, Tall Bear needs your care. They all look confused. They all asked, who? Chief said, ask him yourself. They looked around the room and said, Chief, who are you talking to? The chief said, Tall Bear, he's sitting right there. They asked, where? There's no one else here except us and you. The chief eyes stunned with terror and fear. His face just flared. Moments go by as they all just stare. Hours later, the children walk in the TV from behind their backs. Then look around the circle, then ask, what are y'all staring at? The spider lady turned and said, the chief is very sick and hallucinating. The children said, what chief? From outside, y'all sound like y'all was talking to the ancient. For years, it was only us near the tree called Wounded Knee. Above the hills, who the Sioux and the big waters run free. By the white lake, the night draped in silence over undiscovered landscapes. Daybreak, pine mountains, drink from the many puddles that the rain makes. Bushes of trumpet flowers, wild grapes, marsh showers, and grass snakes. As the sun bakes the empty space near White Lake and Wounded Knee, the birds fly from the tree, cause every now and then that place shakes. The ground trembles just in that spot on the right night. You can feel a mild earthquake. Grandmother's land. In grandmother's land. In the grandmother's land, the time first began. Who was there? Tall Bear? Little Waters? The Chief? Or was it incomplete? Were the three really there? Or the medicine ladies? In grandmother's land, grandmother's land, grandmother's land, grandmother's land, grandmother's land, grandmother's land, one time, and
grandmother's land In grandmother's land Were they ever there? The tall bear The chief In little water In grandmother's land In grandmother's land Were they ever there? The tall bear The chief In little waters In grandmother's land We walk the burning sand kill your mama. And let me tell y'all something. If you want to see the largest homicide rate in the world, it ain't in no black ghetto in America. It's a little town in Australia where them white folks' homicide rate is 200 times what their population is. And that town just happened to be located across the street from a manganese plant. That town is located across the street from a manganese plant. How much manganese are you spraying in my neighborhood at night while I'm sleeping? 